Hello. I'm here to fill out my paperwork. Today's my first Do day. Do you have an appointment? Um, no, I don't. Jim said to stop by when I got in this morning, and I came in a little early to, you know, fill everything out beforehand. You're making me nervous standing there like that. I'm gonna need for you to calm down. Sorry, I get the first day jitters. Well, you need to handle that because one of these days, I might not be this nice, and I don't need to have to worry about you having an aneurysm in my office. Oh, okay. ID? Oh, yes, absolutely. I'm sorry, is that a snow globe? Uh, why, yes, yeah, it is. I'm an avid collector ever since I was a little kid. This one right here is my very first snow globe. It's from New York City when we went to go see the Broadway show the next five years. It kind of dragged on, though. But I thought it'd be appropriate to, you know, brighten up my desk. That's going on your desk? Yeah. Um, I don't seem to have my ID. Can I bring it in to you next time? And Jen didn't give you a specific time to come in and see me? Who in the hell does he think he is? Father Time? I don't think he can control time. Fill out each form, sign on the dotted line, and please bring it back by this afternoon. I'm on lunch from 11.30 a.m. until 2 p.m. Thank you. It was a pleasure meeting you. I'm Kyle. Bring your ID. That, listeners, is the Breakfast of Champions. The amazing number four from Donut King. That's what I have almost every morning before I come in here, listeners. Greatest way to start your day. Wouldn't you guys agree? No. I what, don't know about what? you, but this greasy stuff I'm over. Sandwich? No. The salad is where it's at. We're going to get some quinoa in there, some kale, some farro. Oh, no. We've got some avocado. Oh, no, 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 Liz. Your mic seems to have cut off. Marquise, can you please, please, best right, breakfast guys, sandwich right. yeah, ever. Yeah, yeah, So the best sandwich ever is my mother's sandwich. See, my mom makes this awesome sandwich. It's pretty dope. You have a pizza white bread. You have some ham. You have some cheese. Lather up some butter on that shit. And, I mean, it's the best sandwich Isn't ever. Isn't that just a grilled cheese? It's my mother's sandwich. All right. Well, I think we can all, as a state, agree that the fried egg, double bacon, sausage, and cheese on an everything bagel is the greatest way to start the day here in Dover. We'll be right back after a quick commercial break. Ever since I was attacked by fire ants, I haven't trusted anybody with my oil change except for Ira's auto repairs. I don't know why we have to just discuss your sandwich. This is a panel discussion. When are you going to understand that I am the panel? It's my voice that people want to hear. It's my products that people want to buy. It's called The Morning Show with DJ Jace, Marquise, and Liz. Exactly. I mean, who really wants to hear about the news, the traffic, uh, hot topics? I mean, we have Jace here talking about his favorite breakfast sandwich. Smell a little sarcasm over in your corner, Marquise? No, I just took off my shoes. Oh, God. Hello, ma'am. Welcome to WWJD Radio. Yeah, okay. Um, I missed a 9 a.m. conference call with Terrence at True Channel. When he calls, just tell him I'm down with the flu. He knows better than to schedule conference calls that early. Also, I think I missed another meeting with Donut King about some advertising bullshit that I'll need you to compose an excuse email for. I'm sorry, I didn't quite catch the Again, I ordered breakfast on the way, and it should be here in, like, mm, like 20 minutes. So when it comes, don't call me out. Just bring it to my office. It's a big platter, but you should be fine carrying it. And whose name should I put that under? Mine, who else? Uh, you didn't give me your name. You should know it, what the hell? They changed you out. Sorry, it's Tara. And what do you do here, Tara? Everything. If anyone calls for me today, just tell them I'm not here. The index of excuses is to the left of your phone. If it's Tuesday, I'm reading to the blind. So, should I call the police department back and let them know that you're reading to the blind? 
Excuse me? Hey, sorry guys, I just forgot my phone charger somewhere. Gwen, I don't even know why you pay rent at your apartment. You're always here. Gwen, quit making a lot of noise. All right, let's rock this intro. And Liz, if you're gonna laugh, can you do it in your low voice? Yeah, not that one. And we're back, Dover. We're gonna pan over right now to see what's going on on the interwebs with Marquise in the social media corner. Marquise? All right, guys, I'm scanning through Twitter right now. It's a whole bunch of things going on. It's a lot of things I can't say, but I really want to say. Uh, it's a lot of excess noise in the booth. Whoa! Pizza Dome is no more. What? Oh. At approximately 2 a.m., firefighters were called to a blaze at the Pizza Dome on Wembley Street. You follow the Dover Daily on Twitter? It's Dover's most trusted news source, Liz. Everyone does. What about the Pizza Dome? Ah, oh, nuts. I love their two-liter special running two-topping pizza. We have a live video from it right here. DJ Gwen from WWJD Radio has my back. You're right. This girl is on fire and I use the fuel. Woo! All right, let's go. Found it. Jim! Please don't yell. We're history, do you understand me? She didn't tell the girl to burn down Pizza Dome. She was simply coaching her through a life problem. You can't always tell a psycho from a phone call. Well, I've wanted her off the air since her banjo power hour last year. Thank God the string's broken. No one around here can fix a damn banjo. I called a staff meeting so that we could go over some PR stuff with the group about what to say on air and online about the great Pizza Dome fire of 015. You know what PR is, right? Yeah, public, public relations, Jim. I understand acronyms. <gasps> And that is why you are slowly climbing to the top, Tara. Listen, she needs to be on leave until the hype dies down. The detective told me she could be linked as an accessory to arson. I'll have Charlotte prepare some protocol notes for the group so they understand the shoulds and should nots of how to handle this situation. Why is our head of HR handling PR? She's horrible with the public. It's the difference of a letter, Tara. HR, PR, humans, public. We all depend on relations and resources. What? WWJD has been a trending topic all day long on social media. Gwen, alleged arsonist on oh. air, already pops. We haven't received this much traffic and attention since the year we sponsored the Great Gay 5K in Rehoboth Beach. Remember that rainbow glory. Bask in it. And we know she didn't do anything on purpose. Revel in the publicity and beat the meeting by three. This is bullshit. You're delirious. <laughs> You want to know the monumental difference between this and the great gay 5K? Is that the flames in this case aren't celebrated with confetti cannons. Oh my god! Everybody is talking like they don't understand. I don't want you to